Hi. Let's learn about the CAPE ratio. The CAPE ratio is a valuation measure that uses real earnings per share over a 10-year period to smooth out fluctuations in corporate profits that occur over different periods of a business cycle. It is also known as the Schiller-PE ratio. While the CAPE ratio is a popular and widely followed measure, several leading industry practitioners have called into question its utility as a predictor of future stock market returns. The CAPE ratio is calculated by dividing the share price by the 10-year average of inflation-adjusted earnings. In the cyclically adjusted price-to-earnings ratio, the aim is to use real earnings per share rather than projected future earnings. The CAPE ratio helps assess whether the market is undervalued or overvalued. It considers the impact of economic influences by comparing a stock price to average earnings, adjusted for inflation, over a 10-year period. It is similar to the price-to-earnings ratio and is used to determine whether a stock is over or undervalued. Few companies can maintain steadfast profitability in the face of a deep recession, so the CAPE ratio is used to analyze a publicly held company's long-term financial performance. The CAPE ratio initially came into the spotlight in December 1996, after research suggested stock prices were running up much faster than earnings. The CAPE ratio for the S&P 500 climbed steadily as the economic recovery in the U.S. gathered momentum, and stock prices reached record levels. The elevated value of the ratio triggered a raging debate about whether it portends a major market correction. Critics of the CAPE ratio contend that it is not very useful since it is inherently backward-looking, rather than forward-looking. Another issue is that the ratio relies on gap earnings, which have undergone marked changes in recent years. Here are three key takeaways. 1. The CAPE ratio is used to analyze a publicly held company's long-term financial performance while considering the impact of different economic cycles on the company's earnings. 2. The CAPE ratio is similar to the price-to-earnings ratio and is used to determine whether a stock is over or undervalued. Three. The ratio considers the impact of economic influences by comparing a stock price to average earnings, adjusted for inflation, over a 10-year period. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.